So this is my second session with Dr. Ranger, and it's been four weeks since I last saw him. Um, we're doing live blood analysis here in this first video. He's taking my blood currently. And the only thing that I've changed in the last four weeks is the introduction of this recovery supplement that he put me on to at the, um, at the four week or four weeks ago. I've been taking three of them before a workout and three of them afterwards, and sometimes been taking them on days when I haven't been working out as well to enhance my recovery. To just take a step back, on December 21st, this is what my blood was looking like. Not very good. All of those individual circles are red blood cells. They shouldn't be stuck together like that. They should be free flowing around the place. Three minutes later after taking this recovery supplement, look at them down below there, they look completely different. Moving around, squeezing in between each other's cells, massive big white blood cells as you can see appear on the screen there. It just looked, yeah, pretty amazing. So let's see what my blood now looks like. This looks, looks pretty good already in comparison to the first time. I remember you taking it, me. Bloody hell. <laughs> wow. Pretty fast, eh? Yeah. So it's highly energized still, you know, doing, even though we haven't taken it, it's still the effect is still. Yeah. Good. And I actually just came from the park. I just had a meditation session. Oh, there really? Did you? Okay. Yeah. Okay, definitely that could Because I've been in front of the computer for a while upstairs yeah, yeah. there, I was just feeling pretty blah, so I thought, all right, I'll go and do, I'll just go and have like a five, ten minute meditation, and yeah. that's looking kind of pretty awful. So my blood certainly improved. To remind you also, here is what my electroacupuncture results looked like. Basically, his machine was saying that my adrenal glands and my liver were, were working way under what they should be, and I had higher levels of heavy metals within my body than what, uh, what I should. So let's see what my results look like now after four weeks. Now I'll save you listening to Dr. Ranger go through every single organ system using this machine, but everything, um, well the three main ones that I was scoring um, quite poorly for, my adrenal glands, uh, my heavy metals and my liver, all returned to what he called a normal baseline. Basically everything was online and working pretty damn good, so I was pretty stoked. Now it's time to start testing what different things can actually do to these readings and to my blood. Today's test, jelly beans. Pure, unadulterated sugar. Is that it? Oh my gosh. <laughs> that the is... That's the size. Holy... That is insane. There you go, people. Within like a few minutes of eating pure sugar, look at how completely different my blood is massively aggregated, huge rouleau formation. That's disgusting. I can't wait to go and just eat something good <laughs> after that. That is terrible. So you want okay. to the time it's kind of So a pretty crazy change to my blood. Well when it came to the electroacupuncture machine, I had some significant drops to my organ systems and or meridians. My adrenal glands, food intolerance, chemical sensitivity, nervous system, lymphatic system, liver, stomach, everything dropped like big time. So if something says 25, that's basically meaning that it's working at 50% of what it usually should. Pretty insane. That is how quick sugar works. All because I ate some jelly beans. I'm certainly glad I didn't read the ingredients before I ate them. Check out the ones in bold. So there was no way I wanted to leave his office with blood like that. So I was pretty keen to do anything that I could to get it back to the way it was. We didn't have enough to di time to do what I had planned by doing some meditation. Um, so we decided to take the minimum dose, one tablet of recovery to see how powerful it would be to return it back to normal. And here's the results. Yeah, you can see the oxidative yeah, damage there, yeah. but at least they're flowing way more. Wow. Well, that definitely shows the power of just having one tablet, but you can see how much oxidative stress there is there hugely. Every single one of them looks like they've yeah. got a ring there. It's like we took the blood within like one minute, less than probably about one minute, so yeah. we leave it for, per se, five minutes, and it would still look much better. Wow. 
So that ring is a result of you saying that the red blood cells become a lot more um, dense? Yeah, inside the cell the hemoglobin uh, becomes oxidized so it becomes dense. Dense, and then the light is refracting yeah, off exactly, that. Yeah, exactly. Wow. So okay. it's quite a significant That's uh, pretty huge damage, in one, yeah. for one pill. Yeah. That is insane. One pill lasts supposedly eight hours, hence at the very, very least someone could really benefit yeah. from using this three pills a day. Yeah. You know, exactly. one for one breakfast, down, yeah. one for lunch, one for dinner type sort of yeah. thing. So I hope you've enjoyed this video, guys. It's been awesome fun actually doing it. Uh, look forward to the next ones coming up where I'm going to be testing things like tap water, coffee, beer, uh, the powers of meditation in reducing um, oxidative stress and whatnot. And, uh, mate, if you can get your hands on recovery through the link that I've provided, um, we're distributors now. I think this stuff is absolutely amazing. Um, I'd highly recommend giving it a go. And also, uh, avoid sugar like the plague. Look how powerful it is on your blood. So uh, have a great day. See you next time.